Rain wasn't the only thing pouring down here in Happy Valley as the Penn State offense poured 413 yards on the Terps en route to a 30-0 Nittany Lions shutout. Penn State opened with two touchdowns in the first quarter, one being a pass from QB Sean Clifford to Brenton Strange. The Nittany Lions put 13 more points up in the second quarter, leading 27-0 at halftime. Maryland's first half stats were staggering, tallying only 27 total yards compared to 296 yards from Penn State. Talia Tagovailoa was sacked seven times throughout the game and only connected on 11 of his 22 pass attempts. You know, I think it's always easy uh, to say the quarterback because he, he has the ball in his hand, but I think uh, it takes not just a quarterback to play great, it takes the players around him, it takes the whole new thing that we can get, uh, get executed. Um, so, we just sit here and say where, where he is. Uh, I think he's just like the rest of us on the offensive side of the ball. Defensively, Maryland could not find an answer for the Nittany Lions. Nick Singleton of Penn State ran all over the Terps for 122 yards and two touchdowns on the night. The pouring rain and strong winds led to a more ground-driven approach for both teams, but it was Penn State who capitalized on the running game. Yeah, I think it's um, just execution and focus during the games. Um, we work on it all throughout practice throughout the week, and it just really comes up to showing it um, and executing it when the game comes. And that just comes to you know, fitting the right holes and that sort of thing. But the setting edge is pretty good. Maryland was shut out for the first time since September of 2019, when Penn State shut out the Terps 59-0. But it is time that we, starting with myself, take a deep look at everything we're doing on offense, on defense, on special teams, and find a way to get us back on the right track. The Terps are on a two game skid heading into November 19th's matchup against Ohio State and College Park. Maryland will have to make some adjustments in order to compete with the number two team in the country. For Terrapin Sports Central, I'm Ricky Podgorski.